morning. It is uh, camping weekend time again. I am heading off to Dinakane Game Reserve um, and going to be staying at Kailu Bush Camp, an off grid bush camp in the middle of uh, the Dinakane Game Reserve. Kailu is about an hour's drive north of Four Ways up the N1 past Pretoria. Um, I've never stayed at Kailu before, so I'm quite looking forward to the experience and uh, just getting to spend two days camping in the Dinakane Game Reserve is going to be absolutely epic so I look forward to sharing this experience with you and I will catch up with you again when we get there. We're in for a cold weekend it's only 16 degrees at the moment. There's a cold front moving up from the Cape um, and according to the weather forecast it looks like the temperature is going to drop down to about 7 or 8 degrees tonight. The forecast also shows that from Sunday the temperature is going to plummet down to about 4 um, with very cold temperatures coming in Sunday night uh, moving into Monday. So I've got lots of firewood, We're making a nice big warm fire tonight to ward off the chill. Morning. Morning how are you? I'm fine in here. Good, Good thanks. I'm uh, staying at Kailu. Yeah. Kailu is a lovely campsite um, set in the middle of the Dinakeng Game Reserve. Dinakeng is situated about an hour and 15 minutes uh, north of Johannesburg. So really, really accessible, um, great for a quick weekend getaway. Kailu is an off-grid campsite. Um, there's a fence section as well as an unfenced section, which gives you a true um, bush experience, bush camping experience. There are five campsites inside the fenced section and I think there's another ten um, outside in the unfenced section. Each campsite comes equipped with a private ablution with a toilet and a shower um, and a wash basin for cleaning up all your, your cookware and bri, bri stuff. Um, the ablutions are equipped with um, gas boilers so there's hot water on tap as, as required. There is no electricity so you do need solar panels. Um, to keep your fridges and, and lights and other things on the go but it uh, truly is set in the middle of the bush really really beautiful um, it really is a magical magical experience and well worth a visit
This is the um, private ablution that comes on each of the stands here at Kailu. It's a nice little um, self-contained unit. There's a basin for doing dishes, a toilet and a shower. Um, and they've designed it quite nicely with a cutout at the top of the wall between the roof where you can stand in the shower and look out into the, into the bush. There's a gas boiler, so nice hot water on demand. Perfect for a cold and chilly morning like today. Nice view of the bush felt while you're having a nice warm shower. Good morning. Um, had a lovely evening in the bush last night. Uh, overnight temperatures dropped down to about five degrees, but it was nice and cozy in the tent. I lay there listening to the sounds of hyenas and um, black backed jackal. It really was magic. Such a great experience uh, sleeping out in the bush. Just had a lovely hot shower um, in the gas heated um, ablutions. Nice little open viewing area where you can look out onto the onto the morning sunrise over the bush. Really, really is beautiful out here. But uh, now it's time for coffee and for some breakfast. My last trip to the Kruger Park when we were staying at Inyari, the unfenced campsite, we had hyena coming into the camp um, at night. I'd left my solar panel out and uh, one of them seems to have had an exploratory chew um, on the corner of my solar panel. Luckily he didn't get any of the electronics inside so it's still working perfectly but uh, it's a nice little souvenir from my last Kruger trip.
And for lunch, we are going to fry up some burravos with uh, chopped onion and chopped up potato with a little bit of spices. Just going to throw it in the frying pan and cook it on the gas. Make a nice little fry up hash for, for lunch with some olive oil and wash it down with a beer. Been a fantastic day here in uh, the Dinner King Game Reserve. Went for a bit of a walk, um, had a bit of a game drive earlier, saw a fish eagle um, and a couple of other birds out at the out at the dam. Um, now the sun's just about to go down. The temperature's dropped probably about five degrees in the last five minutes. So now it's time to get the get the meat ready. Gonna have a nice braai, gonna do some lamb chops and a little bit of vorse on the braai and then settle in for the evening. Tonight for dinner we're doing some lamb chops, a little bit of vorse, and we've got a braai baguette which we'll just put on um, the fire and keep it nice and simple.
So that was uh, my weekend at Kailu. Like I said before, it's a beautiful, beautiful bush camp. I had a really great time. It's always special just spending time in the peace and quiet of the African bush. But uh, now it's time to hit the road. Um, an hour and 15 minutes back to Johannesburg. Hoping that uh, the traffic won't be too busy on a, on a Sunday morning. But it's been a fantastic, fantastic weekend. And uh, thank you for joining me on this adventure.